one thing about electricity in winter it's unreliable so i won't sit and wait for the electricity to come back so as a girl you have to make a plan so i guess in this case my boyfriend and i made a plan and we decided to make a fire so that we can cook and trust me we literally spent the whole day outside cooking at this point i was convinced that i would survive in the rural areas because i don't know how I survived the whole day with this whole situation but I did actually even though there were just a few things that were just so uncomfortable for the fact that we had to keep on blowing and blowing my lungs are exhausted they were really exhausted and I felt like I was gonna get like a headache but then luckily for me like it, it just wasn't that severe but other than that the most important thing was that we needed to make sure that we have food to eat Honestly speaking, this fire was a problem. So we'd constantly have to add more wood and everything. And after a while, like I realized that it takes forever for the wood to burn. So I came up with the solution to use the methylated spirits, which I don't know if it's safe, but then that's the best idea that I had at the time because I was just I was tired of just um being outside and doing the same thing over and over again at this point it was already late and my phone was very really low so i couldn't even use the flashlights but then as you can see like we're still outside because we had to boil water so that we can bath so yeah this was just what we're doing later on so today is the next day since yeah the whole electricity situation but today we do have electricity so um so it came back yesterday at around 10. imagine all of that like after um, spending the whole day by the fire imagine i had to i had to cook food on the fire i had to boil water to bath and then i made dumpling too which wasn't i feel like it didn't do so well because um like we had to consistently add more more wood and everything so it was just a lot but then yeah we i like it's not 100 percent okay yeah but like that whole situation from yesterday it left my pots very dirty and the house it's also a mess too and then and also another thing is that like it smells like smoke 
like it smells bad and honestly my lungs are exhausted from yesterday like cooking on the fire is just not it's not fun honestly it just wasn't because like the wood that we're using most of it it wasn't fully fully dry it was a bit wet but then we had no choice because we didn't even know when electricity would come back so uh, I, I thought maybe it was going to be like a week or so because there was no any form of communication yesterday so I didn't have any hope of the situation being sorted out so yeah so that is that and then I guess this is a sign that I need a gas stove but then I also hate gas like I'm really scared of I'm very scared of gas in general but yeah but actually I think it would be better than cooking on the fire which is not so nice yeah so what I'll be doing today is that I'll be cleaning the whole house and then I need to wash uh, my pots they look black as hell and then yeah that's what I have to do today basically yeah and I feel like my hair also smells like smoke yeah I feel like it smells bad I know it's it's been a while since I last showed my hair on my vlogs because I've been hiding it behind all the beanies it's because I wasn't combing my hair basically I wasn't taking care of my hair but then um last week I had to go somewhere so I had to do something with my hair but then right now it looks crazy yeah it does look crazy but I think if I still have time today I'll tr I'll braid it again yeah I'll just I'll just do something just to so it doesn't stay like this yeah but right now we're gonna get started with all the cleaning so right now it's it's around one o'clock yeah I should have started earlier but then I was just I was feeling a bit lazy so I'm gonna get started with everything right now one thing about him is that if I avoid or I take my time doing something he would just go ahead and do it himself he's just not gonna sit there and wait for me to actually do it and on this day I was really procrastinating doing the dishes I'm not a huge fan of dishes you know, I just do them when I have to do them. So we had a bit of flour left so we decided to try and bake something yeah I'm still not good at baking I'm still learning and baking is a bit challenging for me but eventually one day I'll get there and this is what we made it was really nice I tried 